We are looking at some showers just to our west right now, even some thunderstorms as we look at a Zach track 4D radar. I will show you where they are right now, and they are showing some lightning at this time over toward the bit wreck that's area as well as Alma. A few of these showers starting to pop up as you get closer to mid Michigan. Well, these will be tracking through the central portions of the state and eventually getting over to southeast Michigan, clipping some of our counties to the north Lapeer, Sanilac County, maybe even portions of Genesee County getting some of those showers this morning. Otherwise, things looking pretty good here in southeast Michigan. We have a couple of showers popping up as you get over toward Ontario, but for the majority of us, we are going to be waiting until the evening before we start to see those showers and thunderstorms. So this is what we have in store for us. We have those showers that are going to be drifting down, trying to clip us, impacting some communities this morning, and then we will have to see the thunderstorms popping up and firing up later on this evening. Those have yet to develop and move into our area. Some storms a little bit on the stronger side already in Illinois, prompting some warnings at this time. So we do have a risk of some strong to severe thunderstorms. The lowest level marginal risk, including a big portion of the lower peninsula, including places right here in southeast Michigan, primarily to the west of I-75. We are going to be seeing storms even firing up, getting stronger in places such as Illinois, Indiana, down in Kentucky. Some of those places already seeing some of those storms this morning on the stronger side. So we have a couple of little showers this morning that will be making their way across the area north of I-69. But for the rest of us, we'll be waiting until this evening to see storms rolling through the area, and we will see those storms popping up in the evening and the thumb as well. Tomorrow, a couple of spotty showers popping up across the area and a chance of more showers over the weekend. What will be changing over the weekend? Clearer skies. We will have some of that wildfire smoke diminishing moving out of the area. Those winds right around five miles per hour at this time. Very comfortable temperatures this morning. It's going to get really hot and muggy later on today, though. The air quality alert, including all of Southeast Michigan for that wildfire smoke that is making the skies look like this. This photo from Akil 59 and Troy. You can submit your my pics of what things look like as well. We're looking at campus marshes right now. Not as smoky right now across the area. There's been times when it's been even hard to see just a block away. We're looking at temperatures around 62 right now in Detroit. Temperatures across the area ranging from the mid 50s in most places to about 60 degrees. We're at 66 in Gross Ill, Monroe up to 62 also at city reports seeing that number as well air quality index will be showing that we will have poor conditions today unhealthy for sensitive populations and at times very unhealthy that wildfire smoke across the area moving through the area we're going to see temperatures today getting up on the mountain side i'll show you what it looks like for today's forecast right there getting up to about 84 across the area tomorrow even warmer and those temperatures throughout the week in the mid to upper 80s overnight lows mostly in the mid 60s